Hello family, this is Gamers Forum back with another interesting video on Clash Pink. So guys, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe and wish and if you forget on tips and tricks on Clash Pink, you'll get all the necessary detailed details for each event over this channel. So guys, in today's video, we're going to talk about two of the different things or topics you can say over there. The first one is going to be the latest event that is being introduced on the second one. I'm recently going to switch my complete defensive setup from I am having right now Cavalry plus Siege setup for the defense guys but right now i am uh, completely managing it to transfer it to complete infantry plus cavalry defensive setup guys so i'm going to tell you that what are the changes that i'm going to do over here and what are the things that i have to work so that it will give you guys an overview that what are the major component that you should focus on if you are going to follow the same thing that i'm doing on guys so it will give you a complete idea that what you should focus on for that thing, uh, for doing that as quick as possible guys so let's begin with the events guys if we talk about the event let's go to the castle uh, and first one is going to be a new part of eternal light city is being unlocked on guys yes guys this particular one you can get in the port area the eternal night uh, circus guys here you can see over here the first one is a new pet is being available over here the warlord knight is being named on you there are different number of packs you can unlock in by buying packs or the second feature that is being available is that you can exchange the pets or the shards for different of the pets whether it is level one two three or different uh, levels of pets are being available you can exchange it by uh, in exchange of gold or you can exchange it in this particular uh, material whatever you can go on with you can refresh these uh, number of pets available or, or the, the these pet shards by uh, the refreshing and thousand of the gold is being consumed for each and every one of that like this you are able to get different of the pet shards from this particular new event so don't miss out this particular part because it is going to be helpful if you want shard for certain pet in the eaten a night castle guys so now let's move to the other event that is being going on guys so uh, that consists of the mystery box guys you can see over here a uh, new uh, event of mystery box is available out here guys you can draw different one uh, only thing is that you are able to get these particular one by buying packs guys so it's for spenders you can uh, use this particular one and in between you are different number of rewards are being waiting for you in this particular mystery box event then comes the uh, gift from princess event all time favorite alliance recharge carnival is also here more the pack you are getting to buy on in your alliance and the more rewards will be waiting for you it consists of gold some of the permanent wings is being waiting for you it is on luck guys i cannot say you that you will definitely going to go over that a conception event is also going on more the gold that you are going to consume more in return you were able to get over here guys then again the golden chest guys last time i uh, i have mentioned out i don't know uh, it always show this uh, that this particular skin is not being available but right now you can participate in that particular one also guys so these are the event that is being going on the most official event has started on is the dragon campaign guys so don't miss out the dc because huge number of rewards are being waiting for you in the dc guys so don't miss out that particular part now let's move to the defensive gun guys so basically right now let's start with the one that what things that i've mentioned on over the first one comes to when it comes to defense the first thing that should hit your mind is a dragon guys yes guys for the defensive purpose i'm using red dragon previously all the stats is being focused on the hp for the uh hp for cavalry and siege attack basic attack everything is being focused on the siege and ca uh, cavalry because i am having siege and cavalry on the defensive purpose but now i'm working on the infantry so my main thing is that i should use at least all the stats focusing on the infantry and cavalry stats like you can see over here infantry defense uh i have uh, got a skill of that particular one then infantry attack cavalry hp ddr and uh, dd then comes the all soldier unit defense infantry hp 
and uh, i am also having extra attribute and adding out some of the siege engine hp for the extra one guys so basically when we comes about the extra skills of the dragon you should focus on the hp of different of the troop that you can go on with guys apart from the if you are being lucky you can use the counter of the skill shard also as a, a dragon because we know that it is being available or you are able to get those skills from just go to the store dragon skill section and here you can see the frost vertex can increase the counter feature guys uh, you can get different of counter just from just the this fraud one you can get attack defense at hp from these uh, skill fragments by exchange on the daily basis like this a uh, lot of things is being easy right now but the thing is that uh, for a defensive one whatever troop that you are using in defense try to use those things that is going to affect out boosting the defensive troops like if i'm going to go on with the infantry one then i will definitely going to go initializing or depending each and every opener starts on the defensive uh, nature of infantry by boosting up hp and damage this is about the dragon guys okay you can go with any of the skills apart from the the main thing that you should focus on each and every of the attribute is going to be the hp guys because health and damage these are the two different uh, dif uh, different of the things that can be easily achieved if you are able to participate actively then the third thing that comes on for the defense is the dd and ddr it is going to be very much important and for dd and ddr you are able to trust out your complete night angel equipment it will be quite helpful the now we have already done with the defensive part of the dragon now let's move to the dragon world for the dragon world we know that the defense the invincible is going to be the all time favorite for this particular one it can uh, give you also the unit attack defense dd and ddr 35% unit damage 8% and unit critical damage reduction increased by 30% so it is the best dragon world that is being available for the defensive player now let's come to the one equipment guys for the defensive hero i'm going to use the rogers guys but right now i don't have started using the gems over here so what are the gems that i should focus on i'm thinking of adding the critical rate gem critical uh, then counter gems and hp gems for the infantry focused guys because these are the things that is going to help me out it, it can consist of also the unit hp also different of the increasing the basic defense of the infantry unit that is also going to be very much helpful because basic defense of for the infantry is going to be helpful for me a lot so i'm going to go with those jumps for sure so these are the jumps that you should focus on for the defensive purpose you can go with the hp you can go with the critical rate you can go with the counter jumps and you have to go with the what we can say over here uh, basic defense guys yes guys for infantry basic defense is going to help more than as compared to the basic attack but if you are using basic attack for cavalry then it can be useful okay but for the infantry basic defense is going to be very much important so don't miss out that particular part so this is about the gems guys when it comes to the equipment you can use complete six pieces of archangel gold you can use complete six pieces of the knight a archangel or you can uh, and uh, the second formation that i'm setting uh, uh, telling you is that five pieces of the archangel gold and you are able to use out one of the omnipotence guys because omnipotence can give you uh, the armor of omnipotence can give you some of the dd guys so don't miss out that particular formation so these are the formation that should go on with now let's move to the another important part that is going to play a very important role is going to be the array guys yes guys i have also study uh, started working on the infantry array so right now my first focus is to get the double infantry health in each and every of the array up to six okay first second third fourth fifth sixth position can be able to achieve the hp one so i am going to get double of the infantry hp so for that particular one i am working on the synthesizers array synthesizing can give me out here i am going to uh, gamble out array from the platinum trading center right there i am going to uh, get uh, some of the cheap arrays for the infantry and after that i am going to go on with the gambling over here for the synthesis and 
keep in mind guys whenever you are synthesizing array keep that in mind never do it on the lucky day for the array guys because on that particular day it is tuesday of every week there is lucky day for arrays guys so don't do this synthesize gambling on that particular day because you are going to waste lot of arrays on that particular day this gambling rate is slightly reduced guys so don't go with that particular. apart from this any day you can go on that particular one it is good for you and will definitely work after a few of the failures you will definitely going to achieve success over there guys so this is the third factor that i'm going to own. right now guys i'm having around 900 percent of hp for the infantry on the defensive purpose but my main uh, focus is to reach out more than thousand percent for the hero uh, i have start working on the rogers because right now i'm thinking that roger can boost up my hp at another level with increment of the infantry damage and all those things so for that particular one i am started working on but at least at right now roger is also at 52 so i am trying to get it around 54 at least at the level of 54 so that i can get the maximum amount of damage and skill alignment from this rogers guys so this is about the basic one for the attribute section if we saw on here guys as i can see i'm focusing on each and every unit's hp foremost because attack defense and damages can be achieved from different other sources but hp is slightly more important than every basic part so that's why i'm gone with the infantry hp siege engine health and cavalry health over here for the attributes i'm going to purify it to max level as much as i can go on with and try to unlock the more stars for the rogers for sure guys so these are the basic things that i'm working on right now for the defensive purpose and the skill alignment and all those things if we talk about my defensive setup guys uh you can see over a dd ddr and hp is the basic of the dragon glass if we talk about the setup over here for the defending <coughs> sorry then comes out the complete setup over here talents is focused on the uh, cavalry plus infantry bases then comes the dragon word invincible then comes the dragon that is the red dragon then comes the array that is the infantry defensive array then comes the magic book uh, 30 of uh, level 5 and uh, 35 over here i'm uh, using blessing of wind as well as using the bloodlust of fire then comes out the water uh, for the wonder i'm using level six of light of glory and for the artifact i'm using uh, the freer's crown i'm working on this particular one for the defensive purpose but it's not max that's why i'm using odin's long spear right now but i'm going to switch it to freer's crown six over here for uh, getting uh, increment in the infantry stats so these are the things that is being assembled for the defensive purpose. i hope that this is going to help you a lot and give you overview for sure from my end so that's all the previous video guys if you've liked the video content please hit the like and subscribe button for sure i will be back with the other video as soon as possible till then keep going with gamers forum thank you guys